Maybe I took more of a humorous approach to mine and kind of imagined where this idea of life vlogging could go in the future. Humour is a really good tool to make something very accessible for people, you know, and I like to think that these aren't intimidating, they're just colourful, simple things that you can, you don't, it doesn't take a lot to get what they are. The idea of cosmetics all being about kind of outer beauty, but maybe data could maybe reveal more about your inner beauty. This app at the end of the day could tell you you bit your nails loads today and that you didn't smile at all. You know, is everything okay, you know? There's such a mad craze for celebrity culture. Justin is currently sleeping. He has a heart rate of 60 beats per minute and is in deep REM sleep. Maybe you have a crucifix on you all the time, but there's a camera on the front of it so that maybe your local parish priest can see what you're doing at all times. So if you do sin, he will just straight away text you penance, you know. I saw that Tony, give me four Hail Marys and two Our Fathers. If I could give all my data to this phone and it constantly measures it against everyone else in the world, surely there'll be one person in the world I'm most like and just when that connection's made, the phone will ring. And it might only ever ring once in your life. When you normally die, it would say my name on the headstone with father, son, and the years I was alive. And it's kind of quite a reduced representation of me. It's not really a good representation of who I was or how I lived. What if all my logged data, or as I call it, the final score, was on my headstone? Mm -hmm.